So here we have the droid. Uh, this is a, a Samsung Cortex A8 833 megahertz uh, processor, and it has um, a whole bunch of applications. So let's open the, the browser right here. If I do like this, uh, like there, does it turn? Sometimes there, there it is. This this way. So there it turns, and it has. Uh, you click. It has a touch screen. So I can enter some stuff and go on the internet, like uh, say hello. Uh, if there is internet, I don't think there, the internet is going to work. But and it's actually a capacitive touchscreen, I think. So I click search, but it's not going to it's not going to connect. But right here we have um, 3.5 inch capacitive touchscreen, 720p with the HDMI output, which is pretty cool. There's HDMI output, there's uh, some kind of charger and USB kind of connector right here. And uh, so this is like a development platform that uh, Hard Kernel is uh, releasing. It's around $300 and um, uh, it, it has buttons like it looks like some kind of gaming console but uh, it's not really a gaming console, it's more like a development thing. So they have this website where they're showing, um, they have like a, a forum over here. Uh, development forum uh, on, on the Google group where people discuss uh, about the development of stuff, uh, video playback, voice over IP, uh, they're trying to routing uh, the image and some other guys are doing some other stuff and uh, let me check over here uh, this is a development kind of area where they're doing some Linux kernel and stuff boot and Android stuff and uh, over here is a hardware information so it has uh, if we go back Back to the main main one here. It has 512 megabyte of RAM, which is kind of a kind of a lot. And um, if I go and just in the music music mode, uh, you can see it doesn't go all the way around. It goes here or here, like this with the accelerometer. Uh, so it's pretty cool. It has like the one of the latest the Samsung Cortex A8 processors, pretty fast. Um, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth built in accelerometer but it's really like a development kind of thing so it's for developers and uh, a few months ago like three four months ago uh, and gadget wrote about it um, and uh, by the way I'm browsing on the on the arm part uh, desktop hardware in my role but there you have it so it could be cool to check if there was some kind of emulator some video game emulator in here but they don't really have that. And if I click camera, there is maybe... Is there a camera? I don't know. At least the cam camera app opens, but there might not be a camera. Uh, whoa, some API demos. That looks pretty cool. So there we can, uh, we can take some random API demo and we can see that it's doing some stuff showing the... This mode is different than like this. Yeah, there's something, something bugged maybe in that specific one but if you take this one and there I just jump it's not a good idea to jump in the middle of the demo so let's try again but if you see it's showing that it's using hardware acceleration and it's doing some uh, it's demoing the APIs it has a whole bunch of APIs that developers so developer can buy this and do some 3d stuff and then put it in some kind of app and then release it not only for here, for Nexus One, for anything, I guess, maybe, or for at least for optimized for the ARM Cortex A8, and maybe specifically uh, optimized for the Samsung Cortex A8. So if there's some other Samsung Cortex A8, or maybe a device like this, uh, perhaps a hard kernel can work with some other manufacturers, some manufacturer or some brands that want to have a specific product out. So they show this, like some kind of demonstration of what they can do. And maybe uh, some kind of game company say, hey, let's do a, an Android emulator kind of console thing and sell it for $200. Might be possible. Uh, so it's not a 3G, uh, but it is with, um, uh, let's do a, another kind of, uh, uh, let's go in here and uh, bitmap pixels. There's, let's check uh, just some random. There it's a drawing something. It's just a, an API, so there's some kind of, things that the developers can do with this. I think it would be pretty cool to have some, some Android game game console uh, with this kind of interface. Buttons of, on both sides or just have a normal like like a tablet where the buttons jump out and you have uh, access to video games. But this is it, the, the Odroid by Hard Kernel. <laughs>